Soon the city of Cumming will honor a man for his quick thinking. He saved his entire apartment complex from a fire. Fox News Alex Whitler spoke to that man and joins us from the live desk with the story. Alex. Yeah, Courtney and Eric, several neighbors reached out to us saying they're grateful Marlon Priest was observant and quick on his feet. If he weren't, there's no telling how many people would be out of a home for the holidays. But then I saw the flashing lights out of that window. Out of context, this video might look like a home being built. Our old apartment is on the other side of that wall. Sure and while the unit is here, under construction, had to like low crawl to get out of the apartment. This isn't a voluntary renovation. Yes, yes, it's a fire. November 12th, flames broke out at the Aubrey's Landing Apartments. Man. The coming community credits this man, Marlon Priest, yes, with saving their homes, but most importantly, their lives. Priest was working on a car in one of the parking lots. Then the fire alarm went off. Coincidentally, one of his neighbors was cooking and there was a lot of smoke. He went over to check things out, but no one could understand why the entire building's alarm was going off, not just her units. Neighbors called the fire department. They said it was just a kitchen fire and left, but then Priest noticed a few things. Water started spewing into my apartment from under the floors till I start banging on doors. I'm like, hey, y'all need to evacuate the building. And I went back to the apartment on the, the far side that was adjacent to us, and I saw the flames through the window. That's when I proceeded to make sure that everybody was out of the apartment complex. His girlfriend says that's typical behavior. He called her while she was out for errands after he called 911. I'm going to go in and see if there's any people in there. I'm like, don't do that. Once he gets to a certain point, there's just, there's, it's like talking to a brick wall. There's nothing I can do about it. And neighbors are glad that's the case because if it weren't for priests' frantic warning and efforts to ensure everyone was out of the building, their holiday season could have been toast. Thankfully, everyone's okay. Many of the units do, though, have water damage, including priests, so the complex has put the couple in another unit. Priest does have a felony on his record, and he says he hopes this situation proves, despite legal trouble, people can go on to do good things. At the live desk, Alex Whitler, Fox 7 News. Mm, so good of him. Alex, thanks.